Our mission is arts to build community. We push in every single day for anywhere from 30 to 45 minutes per grade level in order to teach core curriculum through arts. Everyone that works here really, really, really believes that the arts can change the world. When Warehouse comes in, we come from a completely different angle. We're bringing the arts, we're bringing in fun. Uh, just the kids get to just relax. They get to get off the normal track. They get to get up and dance. You're moving around, you're, you're acting, you're, sometimes you're rapping. You get to bring out a totally different side of these kids. Red House's extra things become an incentive for a student who may fall off track. And if the teacher and the Red House fellow are working together, it makes it so that the student has a more cohesive group of adults that are on board for them. So there are many benefits to Red House being at Fraser. Uh, it provides our students a time to be creative um, and to design and build and act and write and do things that they may not have the chance to do with the typical curriculum. As I walk around the halls, I see Red House fellows sitting on the floor with our students, talking them through emotions they may not know how to handle. Uh, I see them working with classroom teachers to build a stronger community in each room. Uh, and I see them bringing out the creative side of our students that may not normally have happened. I think for the kids mainly, it gives them something to look forward to. Um, that's not just with me, and it lets them build relationships with people who aren't just their teachers. They never get to see people who do anything other than teach, and so to see people from Red House from who haven't always been in theater, who theater maybe not was their first calling, but to get to talk to adults who aren't part of their daily life has really helped them and helped them build relationships and have someone else that they can connect with in the building has been really, really nice. We're not only there just to teach arts enrichment, we're there to help de-escalate students, to help the classroom teachers should they need an extra set of hands to be a sub, a last minute sub, should they be short for a class period. What we're looking to do now um, is actually look at the way that the programming is impacting each individual school. So having the ability to make sure that the curriculum that we're teaching is culturally relative, is um, rooted in restorative practices, is accomplishing all the things that the district wants us to accomplish, is really what we're ready for, I think, in the next phase of this program and really sitting down and having conversations with the principals of what types of things they would like to see for their kids. I'm really proud of how far along the Red House program has come here in the Syracuse City District. Um, we had the vision, the company had the vision, and they got the right people in place. And it feels like we're really starting to uh, mature, and that won't, that'll do nothing but benefit the children in the district. What we do is, very, is vital. What we do is vital to any community, but particularly in a low, lower performing community. We actually have seen the kids get better. We've seen test scores improved. You have to put some of that credit, you have to give some of that credit to the teachers and the teaching fellows and what they've done. They've helped give the kids a reason to learn again. There's so much potential for Red House to reach these kids. You know, knowing where these kids, uh, some of the backgrounds that they have, um, to be able to mentor these kids, to be able to be there and just, just have them laugh, just get out of their regular character, that, you know, it's, it's so huge. We're always trying to reach the kid. We call it like planting a seed down the line. Somebody else will water that seed. And I think we plant a lot of seeds here. I think we do. And I think sometimes the seeds have been planted. When we come along, we kind of water. We sprinkle some water on it. And to see these kids grow and develop, it's, it's priceless. I'm learning about dancing because that's what we're going to do. So we have to make up our own dance. It's helping me because it's learn. It's teaching us how to do some stuff better. We get to do things that we probably have never done in our life, and we do it in front of a bunch of people. And that helps when we do it in front of people. It help. It helps us not have stage fright yeah. and being in front of a big crowd. 
Red House helped me because in the first beginning of the year, like I really didn't, I really did not like wasn't friends with probably anybody. But then when in Red House, like we did activities together, and I got to know everybody. When we are not only in that class, but when we are out of the class, we learn to be confident about others, and we were confident about what we do and how we should not care about anybody else. I think this program is amazing. Being a part of these kids and being able to build with them and to see them recognize their value by seeing their value through me. You know, and knowing that I'm here. I, no, you are important. No, it is important that you do this. And it's important to me. And it's important to me that it becomes important to you. And to watch them bloom has been the greatest time of my life.